We're going to be seeing the Sheep Herders in action. Now is our final match on this hour of International Championship Wrestling. Here's our ring announcer. Now in the ring, over the combined weight of 480 pounds, him from New Zealand, the Sheep Herders. The Sheep Herders. They're going to be going up against a tough team, so uh, we'll wait for their arrival now. One fall, television time remaining. <laughs> Waiting now for uh, our introductions again from our ring announcer. Al Perez and Gino Delosari. Sheep herders now riling up the crowd. They are an extremely unpopular group. Their opponent, with a combined weight of 465 pounds, Gino Delacera, and his opponent, Al Perez. Al Perez, the co host of the Pad Okay, Al Perez. And uh, brother, what a competitor he is. Delacera, of course, uh, doesn't have quite as much experience as Perez, but it's going to be a tremendous match, and these sheep herders are going to know they're in a fight. There's no question about it. One fall, television time remaining. Waiting now, making sure the referee, uh, making sure everybody understands the rules and regulations. Perez warning them right now. Also, a reminder to... Uh, Remove anything uh, that uh, does not belong in the ring at this time, including the flag. You can see the crowd very, very displeased with the uh, sheep herders. As I have mentioned before about these sheep herders, uh, they have wrestled the world over and are uh, pretty much universally disdained, including, I understand, their homeland of New Zealand. Nobody can dispute uh, their capabilities in the ring. They're a tough, determined combination. And that's why they are indeed the tag team champions. Of course, when you've got men like the fabulous Rockers and uh, others, the Invaders and many others looking after them, Jesse Barn, Rick Rude, and others, uh, how long they'll remain the tag team champions, well, it's problematical. the sheep herder now circling it's Perez Perez moves up collar and elbow and look at how quickly the sheep herder goes to get some extra leverage Perez keeps a uh, firm grip around the side of his head and it's uh, the sheep herder firing away Perez ducks away and connects with a hard right hand and Perez letting the sheep herder know very quickly and in no uncertain terms uh, you want to uh, peer six it will peer six it if you want to wrestle we'll wrestle So we've got some problems here. Keeper wending his way slowly. Back to the ring. In through the ring ropes once again, and the referee. Reminding them to get back to wrestling. That's what it's all about. That's the name on the marquee. Ah, uh -uh, the sheep herder. Using a fist and then complaining to the referee about uh, the fist again. So, what's good for the goose is not good for the gander, apparently. Hurried consultation. Again, men, both men circling. They lock up color and elbow. And again, the sheeper getting in a cheap shot on the side of the rib cage, and smashes Perez's head into the uh, steel turnbuckle. Catches him once again and delivers one, and that looked like he was slightly low. High knee lift into the side of the head, and it is a hard right hand. So the sheep herders, tagging in and out with a great frequency, have uh, begun to dominate the situation. Take down again, good kip up, and it is uh, the sheep herder 
being caught on a full arm drag and twist into a bottomless lock. Good move. Gino and Al. Gino Delosari and Al Perez against the Sheep Herders. The tag is made. Al and Gino picking up the idea of let's get this tagging going ourselves. Sheep Herders again trying to tag up. Bottom wrist lock. Well executed, well applied. Second Sheep Herder starts to come in and he was blocked off at the toss. him coming off the ropes. Good leapfrog. And once again, a spin under takedown. Well executed, the tag is made. And the crowd coming to life as uh, the sheep herders could be in trouble here. Again, punishment to the biceps and triceps of the sheep herder. Al and Gino showing the uh, sheep herders that there are no pushovers by any means. In fact, the matter. They're looking for a pinfall or a submission on the sheep herders. Of course, a victory here uh, for these two would mean that the sheep herders would almost be forced to give them a, a championship match. And that's one thing about uh, the champions, be it a uh, individual champion or a tag team champions, anytime they uh, go on television in a non-title match, uh, if they are defeated, it really catapults their opponents right into number one contention. Now, this is Sullivan Barr and uh, the Nelson. And it is uh, the Sheep Herder now trying to uh, figure a way to escape from this, complaining to the referee, but to no avail. And again, the referee. The count of two. Sheep Herder gets those uh, shoulders off and. Uh, Sort of some inane mutterings coming from the sheep herder. He is a study in frustration right now. Good uh, key in on that uh, arm. And it is, uh, again, the second sheep herder interfering. And this is what they are so famous, or should I say infamous for, is their interference in matches. Delosari and uh, Perez have got some problems now as the sheep herders have weathered a pretty tough storm. Irish whip into that uh, far turnbuckle. And uh, you can hear the crowd picking up the chant, USA, USA. And uh, much to the dismay of the sheep herder who tags up. Clubbing forearm. And uh, a right hand back again, and another one back in the ear. And we've got a Pier 6 Donnie Brook going here. Suddenly, the Sheep Herder catches his opponent in the eyes. Good leapfrog. High drop kick. Let's see if the tag is made. It is made. And the Sheep Herder wasting no time attacking his opponent the minute he got halfway through those ropes. But he's beginning to get more than he bargained for now. Irish whip into the uh, turnbuckle. He charges in, catches him once again. The sheep herder into the ropes, caught right at the belt line. Good snap mare. Drives the back of the uh, elbow down across the chest of the sheep herder. The sheep herder powers out. Caught in another full body slam, coming off the ropes, and he is uh, upset by the second sheep herder outside the ring. Once again, the tag is made, and that saved a possible pinfall. And again, the sheep herder is utilizing those knee lifts with devastating effectiveness. Now has him up a backbreaker. Got a three count. We have a three count. And so the sheep herders there you heard it. The Sheep Herders victorious over the team of Gino Delazari and Al Perez. A tough, hard-fought victory. And uh, that's why they are indeed the tag team champions. <laughs>